Hello, welcome to The Science Kid. I am your host, Quinn Friedman, and in this episode, we're going to be talking about transverse waves. Waves are a series of vibrations or disturbances that carry energy from one place to another without actually transporting any matter. Sound, water, and light are several waves that transport energy without moving matter. In this lesson, we'll be talking about transverse waves. When graphing transverse waves, we graph them as long squiggly lines. First of all, there are giant peaks in every wave. The peaks above the baseline are known as crests, and the peaks below it are known as troughs. If you measure any crest or trough from the baseline, you will find what is known as the wave's amplitude. If you measure the distance from a crest to the closest crest next to it, you will find what is known as the wavelength. Since waves are in series, there is an amount of time between each vibration. This amount of time is known as the wave's period. Finally, the amount of waves per second, which can be found by dividing one by the period, is known as the frequency. Scientists use these four different variables to classify different transverse waves. Thank you guys for watching this episode of The Science Kid. If you did like it, make sure to like, comment, and of course, subscribe down below if you haven't yet. And thank you guys so much for 1,000 subscribers. I hope you guys have a great day, and remember, science can always be fun.